Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Prison Architect, where in the previous episode we predominantly built this cell block on the left here, which is our protective custody area. Now, it is quite secure because we've now got a bridge that goes from the right to the left, which means in order to get there, the only way you can get over to this area, as far as I'm aware, is to go basically through into reception, and again, the only way through that is really through the kitchen because there's only really one way into that one anyway uh or you can go i guess this way but smash through a couple of doors run through all of this area then over into this one so quite a good one we also furnished it quite well as you can see there's a lot of things in the canteen and the common room that increase the grid and obviously the cells are pretty similar in this episode, we need to, at minimum, uh, put all the pipe work in, which is what I'll do now. And then we're going to go ahead and probably spend a lot of money on flooring and make this thing a little bit better looking because we've been spending a lot of time on getting the basics and indeed we're past the basics now. We've done a lot of high grading stuff and a lot of other things like that as well. So I think at minimum, we need to sort out this cell block, get this uh, protective custody. Sorry, I keep uh, calling. I always go to call the solitary protective custody. Now we need to get protective custody finished with all the flooring and then do the solitary and then go ahead and maybe put some flooring in across the area and just sort of slow the pace a little bit on that front as well so cracking on with all of that we can see that the works are coming into place a lot of the flooring sorry a lot of the pipe work in here flooring we do have to focus on let's have a quick look at flooring and we have a lot of options for the flooring in these cells now i'm just going to check across them i'm seeing if any of them give us any negatives to the grading and I don't think they do so that is fine in terms of the flooring in this area I'm probably going to go with a carpet that is a nice complement to the coloured walls and I think we will go with carpet so we've got all manner of options uh, actually no we've got three options really blue blue red and a brown carpet that's the closest we're going to get lay a comfy carpet down perfect for all staff areas and it says that for the other one as well do we want a carpet then in for here i'm not entirely sure but i will put in a concrete tile in there because we should have one anywhere in and around the rest of it mm -hmm. running track lunar field fancy tiles we normally go with just the base concrete tiles in here but i think is that the right the right part i think that is the right one we, we're not going to you know, focus too much on the exact amount of flooring in here. But I do think we want to go with, say, a brown carpet, which will go across there as well. Does it look... Yeah, it looks fine. Okay, while we're on with the carpeting area then, blue carpet, staff room, concrete tiles, not so much. Let's go across here. This is a security room. Security room, we will have a different colour. I'm just putting in the flying in around this main section, so main entrance here, which we do tend to use a mosaic floor. No, not going to use that. Concrete tiles are worth. Concrete tiles are good enough. So there now in. Uh, I think there was someone trying to escape around here, but I didn't exactly see who what it was. Too too busy putting flooring in. Speed of flooring, we've got blue carpet. I think we'll go for a blue carpet in the offices as well that's fine the security room cargo floor is good mosaic floor I think we'll go with mosaic floor we got some spare mosaic flooring storage cargo floor same in here and probably for all of that, actually, now that I think about it. And we're making sure we're done the rest of that's sorted. And under there as well. So there's 20 odd grand just on putting some flooring in. But immediately, much, much better. What I have noticed, and what I haven't done, is hired some more people to um, clean up because it is a bit dirty. So that's that sorted. Foundation then, more. And we want to have this solitary confinement now looking at the type of walls that we can make doesn't want to be colored don't want to have it like orange or anything like that so i think it is the standard brick so let's do that so this is going to be our solitary 
So walls and doors, doors, solitary door, no, jail door, yes, there. Now each one of these will have a solitary door. I don't know whether we want secure doors. I think we just want standard solitary doors. So let's do that. Wait for them to crack on here. That looks a lot better than what it did. And obviously I've missed a huge section on the right there. And under there as well. But at least we have people coming along to sort that out. Ah, don't know if you saw there. The cooks had to come along. So because of that distance that they have to travel, I've got to hire a couple more cooks. So this this area is sorted. Um, this is where we have to put in the solitary area. And we are going to have, probably have more solitary. We'll have it graded. Solitary door. There. And these are going to have toilets in. Because we're generous like that. And <laughs> solitary will go down here. And then up to the top there as well. Yeah, I don't think giving, us, giving them access to toilets is more generosity. More mandatory. Perhaps in poor taste to even joke about that sort of thing. Uh, pipe work then. Bit of a difficult one because we haven't run a large pipe over here. And I don't think, realistically, we're going to get away with the smaller one. So I'll have to run that pipe like so. Alright, that's sorted. So that's our solitary area. Obviously, they're trying to focus on all of that. I will go to the flooring, concrete tiles here, and get these concrete tiles placed because they've just been... It's been a bit problematic for people walking. Not being able to walk... Well, or just the, the, the slow speed that they walk when they're on the ground compared to when they're on the concrete tiles. So a little bit of money there massively speeds up that as well. Okay, what we're going to do, go over to our policy, and we're going to say, recommend, and that's going to change things, so they now get solitary. 24 hours solitary for murder, wow, okay. See, that's not something that I've really ever ran with. We've done solitary previously. Where we've had like say eight hours, six hours, twelve hours sometimes, but not twenty-four. That's quite a high level on there. Over to our logistics and room quality. Just to double check all these ones. These are low grade, and I want to increase the grade of that. Well, apparently, uh, ah, because I didn't go all the way at the back. Yeah, their grading is slightly different. Okay, so I'll go ahead and put a window in. But then once they're done, that's fine. That's okay. I wonder what else. I'm sure radio. Uh, TV, let's, let's put a radio in. Let's put a radio in. But well, we're basically running out of space. <laughs> um, you know, we are running out of space in these cells. So there's only a maximum grade that these are ever going to achieve. And it is really based off the size. It is still an average grade. Average grade across the board. I'm not too... Uh, I'm not too fussed for that one. That is okay. That is all right. It's very colourful with all the, all the grading on, isn't it? That is quite nice. Anyway, so we have our solitary getting sorted. We do need to put the flooring into that. So I'll run the flooring in now. So that goes down to there. In terms of the flooring in solitary, I'm going to use great. Certainly <laughs> not going to use carpet or anything like that, are we? So that's getting sorted, and we have someone trying to go over the fence, and successfully did. That's, the, I believe, our third escape, and this guard, I believe, they have a... Ah, jail keys, baton, stab vest, they do not have any tasers. Okay, I'm going to hire two more guards, and in terms of programs, I'm going to start that guard taser certification. Spiritual Guidance, 16 in the queue. Don't need to run any more. Parole hearing's fine. Guard Taser, we've just started. Alcohol Group, 6 in the queue. Pharmacological Treatment to Drug Addiction is... 10 finished, 6 passed with a 60% pass rate. So, 
At least that's gone through. Still running foundation and general education as well. Checking our bureaucracy, no. Checking our grading, we have nine prisons released and we need to have at least one more before we can see the proper grade, so that's fine. Over to intelligence and informants, I'm going to quickly look around to see if any of these... Uh, people need to be moved to protective custody. It doesn't look like they do, nor do they need to be moved from there as well on the bus. It's just the Storkel and Snitch, Snitch and Snitch next law enforcement. So there we go. So Solitary is now getting placed, so that is fine. Now let's focus on kitchen and canteen, I think. So over to the kitchen and canteen. Flooring. White tiles. Nice cheeky four grand spent there. Not too bad. <laughs> Not going to do the same here. There's no point. We'll just end up cloning it. For the visitation, I think carpet red might look quite nice. Although, not really. No, maybe not. Maybe not. Do we need that? Um, I guess... Mosaic, perhaps, for that. Mosaic, put mosaic in both of those. For the laundry, it's going to be white tiles. For the parole and library and classroom and all of that, we're going to go with wood, which is the most expensive. 16 grand there just on that. Wow. Mosaic in the shop, I think, as well. And in the infirmary, white tiles, followed by ceramic in the back, because I like to place them, and they're really expensive, so you don't do it often. Okay, max speed out, and let them crack on with a lot of this flooring, which immediately looks the place look better. Don't know if it does anything to improve the grade of it. Let me double check. It does not. See, I would have thought that would be the first thing that they'd introduce. If you don't, if you don't have anything but basic flooring, then it would, you know, negate that. I certainly wouldn't like a grading attached to each floor because then that's limiting your aesthetic choices. Because it would be like The Sims, prime example. Um, there's some stuff that's just better than everything else, so you have to go with that but it has to look like that, instead of having a grading that can be assigned to any look. Um, if that makes any sense. I think it does. So I don't mind that, but if you have just the basic... If you don't have anything... If you have the concrete flooring, for example, negative, or just, you know, that sort of thing. Perhaps maybe negative on some of the base ones? Hmm, I don't know. I mean, yard, the mud there decreases a the yard's grade. Paving doesn't, though. Eh, maybe... Maybe we'll see what happens. Anyway, so that's all done. That's graded. That's in there. That's being placed in there. We don't need to do that one. That's all set up. I'm going to check our deployment just to make sure that everything is right. That is fine. Those are set up to be, yes, mixed ones there. Not going to set that up for anyone to work there yet. This one's all staff only. That should also be staff only at the top, which it now is. Down the bottom there. This is fine. That's done. And yes, good, happy. That's exactly what we want. Okay. Over to our policy, we can see that the uh, protective custody, we don't have an option to set any of these. They have to get all of that there. They get all of the privileges for that, so it's just set. For this one, then, we recommend for this one, they get locked, uh, locked down and solitary. We're going to change it all to lockdown because we don't want them leaving this area, so that's fine. Nutritional policy, uh, let's say for them, recommend. It recommends for this person, medium and medium. Okay, that's fine. We could, if we want, and do we want, we could change one of these paroles. Minsec, Maxsec, protective custody. There you go. And have it so they can always do that there. There might there might be a problem because they can't actually access that, but they might be escorted to it, so I don't know. But at least there's been some attempt made. 
So we have, in terms of grants, two grants. Prison manufacturing and cell block C. We also have criminally insane wing. 10 grand advance payment, 15 grand completion. We're never going to do it. There's no reason for us to... Well, we don't have criminally insane prisoners and we don't plan on having criminally insane prisoners. I can pick it up for the grant, but we're never going to do it. So, you know, that's just understand that we're picking up for the money. Over to the gymnasium and common room then. I think for both of these, mosaic floor is reasonable. Followed by some concrete tiles on there. And let's place some concrete tiles in and around this area. So there's concrete tiles in here. For the security room, do you want carpet red? Might, might look a bit angry, but we'll have it. White tiles in here. And then normally concrete tiles in these areas look quite good. They look quite good in here. The standard concrete tiles. The standard cells, so we're going to go with standard concrete tiling. A bit basic, but it's in. Same thing for here. And that is by and large. It's sorted. I'm going to remove the planning from there because I can't, can't for the life of me think on what exactly what that was. I think we we're going to put a wall across and maybe another, another one of these there, but I, I really can't remember. I haven't done this. No point in doing it just yet. But immediately, that just looks a lot better. A hell of a lot better. Right. Is there anything that we need? Automatic door openers would be nice. Where would we put them? Near the yard. In here. And on the door. That would be quite good. Do we need to do that? No. I don't think we do need to do that. We've got most of the stuff there. What I do want to do, be meaning to do it, is find the... The prayer mats and place them in here. I'm also going to dismantle these and move them a little bit closer to the left there. Because prayer mats allow them to fulfill their spirituality needs. So it's always best to have some prayer mats because they can now fulfill their religious needs. I mean, it's a horrible place to put them, isn't it? It's just in the middle of nowhere. But, they can fulfill their religious needs. Should have really rotated that around. Anyway. Yeah, religious needs as well as the like needs for someone's graffiti on the back, it might be. Yeah, religious needs and the Exercise needs. Yeah, I wasn't going to rotate these round, but quite frankly, it's eating away at my very being. So, yeah, let's, let's just quickly do that. <laughs> uh, there we go. Alright, sorted. So, sleep time, shakedown. All areas. 270 places now, so it's massively increasing. A lot of that is in here. There's so many items in this new cell block. And also a lot of items found, including drills. Where have we found a drill? Last 24 hours. Doing a cursory check for this drill. Not seeing it. Let's go seven days. Well, there's a saw thrown in on the left. What a surprise. Set of shears smuggled in. Hammer thrown in. Hammer thrown in. Shears thrown in. Seeing a pattern here. Drill. Actually, of all things, it was smuggled in, into the shop. But we detect it because it goes through there. So, yeah. We don't have a metal detector here. We don't really need one. These prisoners don't leave the area and come back, so there's no real 
no real problem there. So, two more people brought in, just checking around. We do still have some traits. Oh, and that's what I mean. That was that was meant to do connections, phone tap. Not that we really need to tap that phone, but you know we might as well connect up in case somehow, <laughs> and I don't even think it's possible, we get someone in protective custody that we don't know exactly what their traits are. Which now that I think about it, it is impossible. You either know the traits or you don't, and we wouldn't move there if we didn't know the traits, being a snitch or anything like that. But anyway, it's connected up now. I don't know if we get any more information. We'll have to see. Uh, there is our... Once again, our teacher trying to get into here. It uh, is always a problem, that door. Not moving it. No, refuse to. <laughs> Flat out refuse. But anyway, the look at that is quite nice with the yellow wall and the yellow doors. I do like the... I do like the aesthetic of that. These ones, obviously, we've got them as the grey ones because we're not entirely sure what these ones will be eventually, but they are in. So... We have a total of 56 capacity, 12 of that being protective custody, 44 being medium. We have 30 guards in total, 26 regular, 4 dog handlers, 2 patrolling. And we have a lot of flooring put in. So, I think we'll leave it there. Bit of a shorter one. But, I think next episode we'll go ahead. We will probably get some more money and expand and plan or hmm maybe not maybe we work with workshops put a workshop in start training people to work in the workshop start making money start and hopefully finish the prison manufacturing facility to gain 10 grand then get the carpentry apprenticeship work from there more options more money more training and then we have to think about expansion. We don't need, at the moment, to build the yard, the gym, and the other stuff around here. The, the, what we have is fine for the amount of prisons that we have in the facility. But, when we expand, we'll have to build those as well as the kitchen canteen. But it's not a problem for the time being. So, next episode, I think, yes, we'll go ahead and do the prison manufacturing facility. And then we will oh, crack on after that, see how far we get. Might be the prison manufacturing facility. Might be the forestry in here as well haven't yet fully decided but we'll see how we get on as always if i have enjoyed the video and the series thus far comments in the comments thanks very much for watching take care and generic partings